What's good, YouTube? This is your boy DIY Kari coming at you with another video. Today we got a special shoot from my good people, Sophia Kicks. That are you, my OGs, the people that helped me out when I started doing reviews. They sent me over a special shoe, and I'm glad to get it in hand. But before we get to that shoe, y'all know I got to get this out the way. This is an informational video. This is my opinion only. Everything in this video that you hear from me is my opinion. And I'm easily teaching myself and teaching y'all at the same time about how far these shoes have came and how they look today in today's time. So further ado let's get straight into the shoe oh hold up hold up i have to ask i have to ask please like comment subscribe it really helps with the algorithm i'm just asking for a favor because it's free just like comment subscribe to the channel if you don't want to subscribe leave a comment leave a thumbs up it definitely still helps. Really appreciate y'all. Now let's get into the shoe. The shoe we are talking about today is, I believe it comes out at the end of the year in December. So this might be a Christmas shoe or before, I don't know. But this is gonna be the Retro 5 Black Cats. And if y'all are true sneakerheads, y'all already know they got the Retro 4 Black Cats. So this is the iteration of that shoe. And I'm not a big fives person, but I actually like this. This is super cool. With the blacked out Jordan Man in the back, the arachnid Jordan Man on the tongue. And I've been pointing that out every single four. So I gotta point it out on the five. If y'all see more than two posts, send it back, take it back, return to sender because it should not have more than two posts if it's below a size 12. If it's below a size 12 and you see three posts for the air bubble, send it back. But on to the next thing. <laughs> I just have to point that out because they, hey, some shoes just be done wrong. As y'all can see, it's a icy bottom with the Jordan man at the forefoot. Then you got a Jordan in the middle. You got the arachnid mesh. Same thing on the front with the all black laces. You got the lace locks there. Jordan under the um, tongue. All black inside. The liner that is. Go ahead and get this. It's gonna be a regular foam insole with the Jordan on white Jordan. So this is not dream cell this is not nothing else it's the regular foam insole definitely has the bubble on both sides and this is true to size this is my size size 10 they fit good on feet no complaints there no complaints with smell, which I never have any complaints with any shoe that I get from Sophia Kicks. I do not have to let their shoes sit outside at all. I don't have to hose them down. <laughs> that's my new thing saying I'm hosing shoes down because that smell can be horrific. If you get a shoe like that, you will know. But I have never dealt with that with Sophia Kicks. That's gonna be both shoes. Jordan, Jumpman. This to give y'all a full view. 
And as y'all can see, there is no glue lines either anywhere on this shoe. Which that's a big thing also that I've been pointing out. They definitely did a great job. And you know, because this is going from black to black um, new buck, which is super buttery. Toe box bounces back. It's the right shape. The one thing I I hope when the release comes out, I know they're not reflecting now, but I hope when they release that the eyelids are reflecting. That's one thing I hope that they do change in the release. I feel like they should be reflecting, but Still got a few months till it comes out, so we will see. The shark teeth, perfect on both. <laughs> Not much I can say about these, like it's an all black shoe. You can't go wrong. You can never go wrong with an all black shoe. The thing that makes these stand out to me though, is that icy bottom. I actually love that. Now, if they did this on the retro floor, that would be crazy. But you know they're not. Again, these are from Sophia Kicks. All the information will be in the description below. They definitely did a great job on the classic shoe is the retro five especially for it to be the first time that they're doing this i think yeah because i don't think they never called i don't think they ever called the shoe the black cat so this is the first iteration as far as i know i know they used to be called the arachnids so that's gonna be the black cat five let me know what y'all think about these in the comments Will y'all be copying these early or will you just wait till they release next year? I mean, end of the year. Like I said, I'm glad to get these in here early because I actually like these and I'm not a real retro fire person. I don't like the way they're cut to the point where this, even with um, high socks, for some reason this messes with my ankle the back of my ankle, but I'm gonna get either try. I didn't feel that when I tried them on, but I didn't have them on for that long also. So we'll see, but I know this is real padded, like thick padding. Most retro fives are like that, but don't know. We'll see. Again, SophiaKicks.ru, appreciate y'all. Definitely look these up on their website if you want them. Again, there's no flaws with these, no smell, no glue lines. Everything's on point. And before we get out of here, for the people that love the boxes, I gotta show you the box. It's gonna be the regular retro fire box. That is my size. As you can see, it says Black Off Noir. Jordan logo. Got the infamous writing on the back with the branding. And inside, you got the paper. That's it. That's all you get. But that's going to be the box. It's going to be the shoes. We like them. Like I said, these came from SophiaKicks.ru. Information is in the description below. And thanks again for coming back. Thanks for watching. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you like what you see. I definitely got more videos on the way, so stay tuned. This is going to be your boy, DIY Kari, checking out. Peace.